My name is Paul Stanford. I am the founder and director of Hempstock Festival, hempstock.org. I moved to Oregon in 1984 to work on an initiative to legalize marijuana. It's good to see your dreams come true. I'm stopped by people often who say, you know, you really made a difference and that feels really good. Hempstock isn't just about legalizing marijuana, though that was a very important step. Marijuana prohibition was never really about drugs, that's just a smokescreen. It's always been about money and power and the centralization of economic and political control. When we restore hemp to its rightful place, because it is the oldest crop, it's been cultivated at least 12,000 years and maybe over 30,000 years. We've co-evolved with cannabis and it's the most productive crop for fuel, fiber, food, medicine and fun. Our ultimate goal is to replace petroleum and stop the petrochemical poisoning of our planet. People are able to come out of the closet. So many people are in the closet. They're afraid about the consequences of talking about cannabis. There are stores, there's an industry growing, there's tax revenue coming in, there's hemp growing, there's medical patients. We've got all of those that are now legal. So far, since January of this year, the state of Oregon has pocketed over $100 million in tax revenue. If you want to legalize marijuana, you've got to educate your lawmakers and your citizens in general. Getting out there and telling the truth about hemp for fuel and educating yourself and others is the essential first step. You know, I think anyone who supports ending marijuana prohibition and restoring hemp will see a vote from a lot of people who are in favor of this. Restore hemp! <laughs>